It's that time of year again. We're heading to our first school uh -huh. of the year for our yearly Fired Up Friday, bright and early tomorrow morning, 6 o'clock. You want to wake up for it. Yes, so here's a look at where we will be kicking off the season. And we're so excited. <laughs> the man Joseph's behind up for it. Fired Up Friday is with us, Joseph Payton. Great to see you, Joseph. Yeah, it's good to be on here to talk about yes. Fired Up Friday. Finally get football season off and going. It's been a minute. You what know. are you yes. doing to get ready to wake up tomorrow morning? You have your alarm clock set. I don't think you don't drink coffee, do you? I'm not a coffee person. So what do you, what do, you do to uh, You know, the cold up. drink caffeine beverages, the Alani okay. News. We've yeah. got plenty in the fridge. We'll be ready to rock and roll. <laughs> okay. Stocked, ready to go. I'm ready to go. Set a couple um, of alarms. A couple of alarms. That's mm -hmm. my biggest fear is like going to bed the night before and you don't wake up so I like intermittently wake up just praying that I don't no, oversleep. oversleep hasn't happened yet I've locked myself out of my car on a Friday morning before oh but well, we're okay we're undefeated yes. in that regard so well, we're getting things started what yeah. at Rock Hill tomorrow morning yes Rock Hill Ooh. out 93 in Lawrence County Ohio they uh, from what I understand they're pretty fired up about it so I heard there's even going to be breakfast in the parking lot they're really yeah. doing it up big they're doing a student breakfast from what I hear at 4 30 a.m. I don't know if I'll crash that party I probably should <laughs> go out there and hang out with them That'll but they're doing it right breakfast and, and the whole nine. Well, and Joseph, there's a lot of pressure on the very first school that kind of sets the tone for the whole season because at the end of this, you give out some hardware oh, to the yeah. school that you feel like was yeah. the most fired up. That's right. And you know, some schools don't know that when we first meet with them. Then uh -huh. whenever I say, hey, there's a trophy at the end of the uh -huh. year, by the way, and you know, we all <laughs> vote on it at the end of the year, you really want to make that good first impression if you're the very first school. And so right. Rock Hill knows that. I think they're up for the challenge. But yeah, this will start uh, that friendly competition for the next 12 weeks. And don't we hear, Susan, he's going to be putting some extra miles on the car this year. I think you're going to some places yes, that are going to require places. a bit of a drive yeah. for you, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're going pretty far. I tallied it up to and from the station to each school. Uh -huh. um, it's like 1,114 miles. My goodness. So it's, uh, it's a lot. We'll be yes. gassed up. For yeah, sure. that's good. <laughs> but we love seeing it. I mean, I I even make sure I set my alarm to make sure that I tune in every Friday because it's just fun to watch the kids, the school spirit. They're so yeah. excited about their team and their school, and you can see it in these highlights. I feel like this is about the only way that you're going to get high school students oh, to yeah. wake up yeah. that early. Yeah, in the morning. I wouldn't have done it when I was in high school. I mean, maybe you know if they would come to St. Joe on an early Friday morning, uh -huh. we'd have done something about it. But yes. uh, I was not a morning person. I'm still not. But for this, absolutely. We'll do this any day of the week, but Fridays for sure. Well, and and the yeah. three of us grew up around here, and I think uh -huh. we've all found yeah. ourselves at one point saying, yeah. man, I really wish they had this oh, when, I when I was in school. I love what you're doing. And Joseph, you're the face of Fired Up Friday. Yeah. Everybody sees you out there having a lot of fun with the kids, but this is a whole team. Uh -huh. yeah. I mean, you all work on this day in and day out. Like, the work doesn't stop even when football yeah. season's over right. because now you're doing it for basketball, yeah. too. But talk about the team effort and everything that you do behind the scenes that people yeah. may not necessarily see. Yeah. As you all know, just because you work here and you kind of see the behind-the-scenes uh -huh. stuff, there's so many people that help put this together, whether it's our news directors, Jay Melvin behind the camera, uh -huh. our producers each Friday morning, Dwight, who's back there looking at uh, the screen and figuring out what camera to punch, John Robinette, who's fixing all of our problems, <laughs> internet related, um, Sarah Banks and our camera folks. I, I could go on and on about that, but also um, the schools. You know, when we yes. go and meet with them, I say, look, it's your pep rally. We're just coming to be there for it, and you right. just tell us how you want You're this. Just along for the inside. ride to show it to everybody else. Right, That's great. and so it's uh, really the, the schools do a lot of the legwork. We're they just do. making sure we're on the air and that it looks and sounds good. We yeah. can't wait to see it. And these thundersticks. What's funny is in the newsroom we all blow these up. Yeah, we call it th Thunderstick <laughs> yeah. Thursday. Yeah. is what it's known. It's everyone's Thursday. lightheaded. We actually, you know? um, everyone <laughs> here blows <laughs> these up <laughs> that you then see the kids having yeah. fun with. Mm -hmm. But that, I mean, it is fun. I feel yeah. like I don't know. It just brings school. Spirit 
spirit to everybody all across, whether you go to that school or not. It yeah. just really gets everybody going for the day. Yeah. I think that's what it's all about. It, you know, being proud of where you're from and uh -huh. where you went to school. And, and you know, maybe uh, for some of the older folks that, you know, you're an alum of Rock Hill or yeah. wherever we're going, maybe when you watch that or if you go with your kids, you start to remember some yeah. of those those good memories you had. Make them even prouder well. of their school. Well, Absolutely. and you watch and, and you look and you go, man, things have changed over the years because a lot of these schools look different than maybe when yeah. we attended. Um, <laughs> so it, you're right. It brings back a lot of great memories. So it all starts, what, tomorrow morning, 6 o'clock? Tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. and we'll be doing it between now and uh, November 8th. I've got 12... Friday's booked, <laughs> so saddle up for it. It's going to be a while. And a lot of energy drinks <laughs> yes. back to wave for it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Lots of alarm clocks set. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much for stopping by and we getting are looking us forward already. to it. Yeah. Have yes. fun with it. Yeah. <laughs> and don't go anywhere.